There was um, an artist in the 1970s called Joseph Boyce. Art is for everybody. And he coined that phrase. He liked the idea that it wasn't just, you know, for professional artists, that, you know, all people could be part of that. So the purpose of the workshop really is to kind of bring ideas together. We might not finish them, and it doesn't matter, really, because the idea is more important. So even if we have rough ideas, they can be translated into something quite finished. The idea of publicness or the idea of being on the street or the idea of protesting can be as simple as getting a black piece of cloth and uh, a bucket of paint and just inscribing something. And you see that all the time, right? I also like the idea that that could be made in five minutes, right? Like literally bucket of paint on the floor, done. But it, I think it's powerful, right? We can talk about flags, but we're not really talking about flags. This is my argument. We're talking about cultural identity. If you think back a hundred years, you had a very binary notion of what cultural identity was. You were either Irish, Catholic, nationalist, Republican, or you were Protestant, Unionist, Loyalist, right? Those two binaries. And of course, skip forward a hundred years, and cultural identity is just really expanded. My project, in a way, in the museum, it's called A Flag for Ireland. See the colour space that's on? Oh, it's exactly the same colour space, so from graphic design point of view. But this is my uh, pop art version, which, you know, does something different. Some of you guys are that vintage, right? So you're, you may remember, certainly, um, those very early, I think this was the first Pride March in Ireland. Protest banners and flags are about the same thing. How do you make something that just stays with people? You know, like the pride flag, it's the colors of the rainbow, so people will always remember it. It's a clever design, but it's quite a simple design. Protest banners can be incredibly powerful just as a text, and this is something we should keep in mind, just even in, even in terms of how much time we have to make these things, right?